In the previous video, we successfully bootstrapped a standalone Angular component. In this video, we will leverage the power of Angular schematics to generate a standalone component out of the box with a single command. To generate a lazy loaded component, we can type ngcc foo minus minus standalone. This will generate a standalone foo component. If we explore the generated foo component, we see that the component's decorator already contains the standalone flag, which is set to true. Furthermore, it also imports the common module. This component is now ready to be used. So let's switch to the app component and add the foo component to the imports array. Note that we add the foo component to the imports array because it's a standalone component and not like an ng module word where we would add it to the declarations array. By adding the foo component to the imports array, it now becomes available in our app component. So let's remove all generated demo code from our app component and just simply use app foo. If we now run our application, FooWorks is displayed in the browser. So we successfully integrated a standalone component. But of course, this component is eager loaded. And in more advanced scenarios, we want to take advantage of lazy loading. And that's exactly what we will do in the next video.